welcome back today into another video i'm posting quite regularly now i th i hope but yeah today i wanted to show you a team that you can make coming towards the end of fifa so yeah uh, most of these players were objectives or spcs so you can't you might not be able to get them any anymore but a few of them i got from packs and stuff for example this Laporte on the bench was from a pack I opened like just about 20 minutes ago. And this Lanzini was an objective so you can't get him. So that's what I meant by that. So let's start. Starting off in goal, we do... Oh yeah, I was just checking that. Starting off in goal, we do have Tim and and Edison who's played 45 games for me. Although technically he's played way more games but I put him into an SPC and then I got him again. So yeah. Uh, centre backs, we've got Mina and Sanchez. Left back, we've got Alex Tellez. Oh, no, sorry, sorry. Then we go to right back. Right back, we've got Hector Bellerin. So this is the, the, the defence for my Premier League team at the end of FIFA. This is it. And then going into the midfield, we've got Lingard on the left because he's right footed and Foden on the right because he's left footed that's what we're going with the two CDMs is Rice and Phillips no preference as to why I have these two like that I just do so yeah that's that is the midfield for this team which I really like my favourite player from this midfield is probably Foden recently because he's been scoring some banging goals long shot goals as well which is surprisingly one of his lowest shooting stats my second favourite is Rice because he tracks back nicely. Now this is where I have to change what I'm searching for a bit. Alright, and then up top we've got Adama Traore and Fernand Torres. Now I am looking on Thursday, which when this video comes out will be tomorrow. I am, I am hoping tomorrow to get this card right here. If I just show you real quick, sorry about this. I am hoping to get this card right here. Good sink. Sorry. I am hoping to get this player right here. And probably put him in instead of Fernand Torres, I want to say. And do that. Or maybe even sometimes do that. I'm not 100% sure what I will do. But what I might do actually just to get. Just to get him to 10 chem is that. Oh, it's not even 10 chem. Never mind then. What what I might do is just play about with that if and when I get do get this card. Like if you have a look now, uh, there. this card is going for 180k. What's his lowest price, do you reckon? 155. Yes, yeah, so he's not he's he's not going lower than 150. Oh, 148 then. But even his bidding's quite higher still. But yeah, so I might get him, might not, who knows really. But yeah, this is my squad. This is my squad right now. Uh, sorry, this is my squad right now. What might happen though is tomorrow, if if I do want to get that cane or a better, I don't know, I'm not sure. Like maybe about a striker or something. Then what I might have to do is you might see me change them too. And then obviously get him a centre mid to CDM position modifier. Because Phillips, I'm not sure how much it goes for. Let me check. Calvin Phillips. Only 36k, 29k. But he is going for like 24, like 25, 26-ish K. Because I got him for... No. I got him for um 25K. So he does go for about 25, 26K. He sells for that. So I'll probably have about 70K. So if we do look here... About... Let's just go with bang on 70. Oh, or not. Let's just go to 70. And then turn this one into... I'm really not doing this fast. Uh, like that. 
and let's see what sort of cards I can get. Oh, I can get this Ben Chilwell card. This Ben Chilwell card, I have wanted for a while. And he would help my England squad, which I'm trying to make. But then again, I, I, I wouldn't have any strikers for an England squad, really. But, yeah, there are some good cards I could, I could get for AK. Like this Mane card is quite decent. His agility is a bit bad, so is his balance, but... Like, I'm talking about for, like, September. He's bad. This Sterling card is really nice, but... His agility and balance is alright. What's his weak star? Uh, weak foot is 4 or 5 star skill moves, though. So, yeah, there are quite a few good players you can get for quite cheap. Quite cheap, actually. Uh, this guy's 4 star, 5 star. This guy, Son. Full stuff I start, but yeah, uh, let me just check something. A few of you might, might not really care about this, but I do, and some of the fans might. But some of our cars are going for quite a lot. Yarmolenko is someone that I wanted to try and like, just try, but it turns out that he wasn't actually that good. So, like, granted, I did only try for like one game, but you know. But yeah, but there are cards that are even cheaper, look, 92 Mason Mount. But what you could do, instead of paying for Mason Mount, is you could do this. Let me just quickly show you if it's still there. Yeah, what you could do instead is just go into draft and win 12 games. It's not the same card, but it's still a good Mason Mount card. I think I might spend some time doing these actually because I do quite like draft. So what I might do is take the money from for, from division rivals, take that tomorrow, not tomorrow, sorry, yeah, yeah tomorrow, and then yeah, do all these because these are good. Like you get a prime goal players pack, you get a minimum eighty four player pick, you get a mount, you know, you know, like you get all all these good players. You get a special Wayne Rooney. You get this good Roberto Firmino card. Like you get like loads of good things. So what I might do, what I might do, what I'm going to do is do draft like for tomorrow, the day after, whatever. But yeah, so far I just need to assist. No, I just need to score in one more game using a left wing and a right wing, and then I will get a jumbo rare players pack with a premium gold players pack. And I'll also unlock a FIFA 22 reward. This one I'm guided about because I forgot to do day one. And I could have done all of them. i got a mega pack. And a coin boost. Actually, oh, a coin boost. Is that it? Actually, I'm quite glad that I didn't get that then. The league of their own has got all these. But, uh, but I've already done the Premier League one. But uh, what do you get? A league of your own pack in FIFA 22. Actually, actually, I think I might try and do this one then. Because I do love Premier League. That's what I try and build my team off most years. And then I just get a couple of players like Ansu Fati, who I quite like, who's Spanish, who links with a Dharma Traore. So it's still 100 chemistry. So I do like having like a couple of, of them sort of players. But I'm going to try and do this. Yeah, that's what I'm going to do. Yeah, it's not even, oh, so this is separate, this is just assist three goals, score five, score four, got plenty of goals. So League One, Bundesliga, Syria, I could potentially do in one game, but La Liga is the only one I have to do in separate games. So that's what I'm going to do tomorrow, League of Your Own. Sorry, today, when you're watching this video, I'm going to be doing these. And this one's going to be done. Duh whilst you're watching this video. But what I do want to try and get, sorry, before I end this video, is this Premier League Prime Players Pack. Because I do want to see who I can get. And from this one, I'm probably going to pick Rodrigo. Because I am trying to build a Spanish squad, but I do only have 9 days to get 62,000 XP. Which, with the amount of um, challenges they're bringing out, seems possible, but I, I'm not sure if I will get it. But, yeah. Stay tuned, because I will be showing you in nine days, I will be showing you the um, season pass for the final season, season nine of FIFA 21. 
I've been Ashton, I hope you've enjoyed this video. And yeah, this is a cheap, well, for me it costs literally zero coins. But this is my Premier League FIFA 21 squad. Oh, sorry, sorry. I should need to do that. This is my FIFA 21 Armour oh, Team Premier League squad. Hope you've enjoyed. See ya later. Peace.